Let's brew. Turn on the throat! <laughs> Which one? Wait. Oh, no, there's oh. one up here. Oh, okay. I lied. You can just... Yeah. Love that one, and then... Fruit? Get some hurts. Some hurts? No. Oh, no. okay. I got it. You sure? I'll make it. You sure? No. Oh, that was <laughs> rude. That was close! I'm just gonna go grab that bar that's... Bar? Go grab that bar. That bomb that's farther away. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh. Oh. Can you do Wait, thing? what is this here, though? Oh. Ah, I'm just looking. I'm scouting. See, I'm scouting. scouting. Scouting ahead. Oh, whoops. Dude, Link is a. But, anyways, Link I was is gonna. Link a trailblazer. He doesn't scout. He, I was gonna he makes say. The path. For. Let's see, which one? So, what is your favorite burr? Um, I typically like coffee stouts <clears> a lot. <throat> I. That, like, um, if you get some. I love breakfast stout. That's why Zach. Told me about it and all. <laughs> um, Zach spammed me and I still didn't, or I didn't get the KBS, yeah. But um, I love breakfast stout. Um, I've had some mint chocolate stouts. Ian got me one for a late birthday present for my birthday. I love those. And uh, there's supposed to be like a Neapolitan ice cream oh, stout that's that at World of Beer right now. That would now. be interesting. Yeah, it's supposed to be really good. Uh, oh, okay. So for, like, I. I'm have not been a fan of Damn it. food. Please. Like Please. flavored burr or drinks in general. Yeah, that makes sense. In Oh no, hold on. I was about to go into another story. So I need to finish my previous story. Alex, Mr. Beer Snob. So I got Oh wait. Motherfuck. <laughs> we are like Too much story <laughs> happening. <sighs> Bonza! Or Pusa? Pusa! <laughs> is that you? It is! I'm ple- Oh, I need to like do like a- It is! I'm pleased to see you're okay. Bird person is pleased. <laughs> My god! <laughs> <laughs> I must say, you traveled far for a one with no wings. <laughs> That's trying deep. To be like, That's deep. I'm trying to be like- Yeah. Oh, and I need to like compose myself. And your sister, is she, is she one without feathers? <laughs> you need to continue. I'm trying to be fucking serious here, Connor. <laughs> is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. <laughs> I just thought, I have an idea, Poonsa. Would you like to meet our chieftain, Peter? <laughs> <laughs> Squeak, squeakity squeakins. <laughs> I told you my people are here. Oh, I can't do Quagmire. <laughs> Giggity goo. I'm certain the chieftain will befriend you and lend you the aid of our airy. Whatever. It's settled then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone know you're coming. Come inside, Poonsa. I'll be waiting. So, Alex, um, <laughs> I have this growler. How much? Uh, no, we're good. I have this growler full of big, immensely bitter, strong IPA. Its name is Palette Wrecker. I think, like, the name itself. That's awesome. So, I was going up, not just Alex, I was going to everyone in this party. I'm like, try this beer. <laughs> yeah. Everyone's just like, oh, what is that? I'm like, this good beer. And then I, like, took it to Alex. And then uh, he grimaced and, like, was like, oh, this is terrible. I'm like, then don't say you're a fucking beer snob. <laughs> he, he has since grown into new tastes. Ah, uh, so you're a poo saw, are you? Quill has told me about you. That really hurts to do. I was, like, pinching my nose to try and make that. Ah. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> a troubling tale indeed. I insist you let us know if there is anything we can do to help you. We shall do everything in our power. Look at that dude. The two dudes behind him. Those eyes. They're just like, don't <laughs> fucking mess with us, <laughs> motherfucker. Please don't mind them. 
their eyelids are permanently open. It's they, they it's, know what Link has done to it, chickens in previous it, games. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's kind of creepy, but they just have a sight, and you, you can't escape it. <laughs> <laughs> They're sitting there like, motherfucker, McGurk. 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 You, you like accidentally trip over a chicken on can, the way. Yeah, up. as you can see, we of the Rito tribe are profoundly connected to the sky. Unlike our chicken brethren, <laughs> we make our living on the airways. Which is pretty beneficial in a land that's literally all sea. Like, we don't have to deal with that shit at all. <laughs> it is the scale that enables the Rito to grow his or her wings. It kinda sucks for depending on a dragon, but whatever. <laughs> Recently, however, the once gentle Valu has grown violent and unpredictable. I mean, he's a dragon, so I'm not sure why we're surprised by <laughs> this fact. This continues the fledglings who are of, of, of age. Of, 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 of. We'll never be able to receive scales from Valu on Dragon Roost. That's why this place is called Dragon Roost Island. Get it? <laughs> you skipping over my text, brah. I was trying to. <laughs> As Chief to the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem by doing jack shit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the fuck to do. <laughs> but you know what? I'm going to trust this 10 year old to solve my problems <laughs> for me. I think that'll well, work. We don't really know at this point. You just go wing your wand or sword yeah, around. Yeah, and... You can help, right? <laughs> Why don't you play some music for the dragon? Right? Yeah. Can you help? I, I can help. My apologies. I, 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 <laughs> okay, yeah, okay, cool. Sweet. Chieftain, what do you think of consulting... Poonsa? There's no, like, there's no yeah, yeah, punctuation, yeah. I feel like. With regards to your son, Prince Komali. As you can see, Poonsaw is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Komali would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. Are, have you met the boy? <laughs> he is... It, wow, that boy! <laughs> Let me be direct. My son Komali is of the age to earn his wings. But he is a chicken, and not, not in the way, like, we're brethren, it's like, he's a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> All he does is play video games. <laughs> he won't st <laughs> Go outside- it is a paradise out- and you are out you there! Have you could have wings if you were fucking paid attention and tried to fucking no focus red on yourself. No Red Bull required, you <laughs> could just go get wings! <laughs> What, what say? say you? What say you? Will you? Will you defend Rohan? <laughs> 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 what say you? What say you? Will you meet with my son? Yeah. 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 You're not saying anything. <laughs> you're just nodding. I, I can't tell if you're actually going to do anything. Will you jump off this cliff? <laughs> See, you just nodded again. You're totally bullshitting me. <laughs> I have something I wish you to give to my son. A young girl named Medley. Here, hold this. Are you seeing all the musical themes in this? <laughs> it's a thing. I'm counting on you. Oh, she has her best friend also. Don't forget to talk to Harmony with an <laughs> I. <laughs> Who knows? Did I come in handy? Oh, it could fun. sound like we get, we're in like a strip club here with all these names. Yeah. <laughs> and on the stage, Medley! <laughs> with so many, have you ever been to a strip club? Yes. I actually went before I was 21 to a strip club. Huh. I went to a strip club in Akron, which is, is not a good strip club <laughs> by any means. I have never been... It's not, it, it was, the strip club I went to was, uh, <laughs> it was I, not good. I, <laughs> it's gonna sound awful. It's a metaphor. It's completely awful, but this is how I view strip clubs. I wouldn't pay to look at food. <laughs> that's uh, that's well, pretty I, awful. Yeah, it's an awful <laughs> metaphor, <laughs> but like, if I'm, I'm gonna go there and it's like, there's a bunch of women naked. And you just have to sit there and watch them. Like, I... I don't know. 
I don't I don't see the benefit in that. <laughs> like some people are like, I oh. guess it's like equally bad. Just the general premise of a strip club. Yeah, in general. I mean, <laughs> new age man. But it, you know, it's you ladies do what you want. It's your body. It's your rights. There's male strippers. It's all equal. <laughs> Chippendales, man. You know, and honestly, I'd probably be more inclined to go to a Chippendales than I would a strip club. A what? Club. A Chippendales than I would a strip club. What is a Chippendales? It's a male strip club. Oh. Like, very, very muscular dudes. Okay. Like, you know, um... Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Really fat dude. He was on SNL. Chris Farley? Yes, Chris Farley, like his dancer routine. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be like a parody on Chippendales. That makes sense. Like that outfit, it was like yeah. what a Chippendales okay. dancer would wear and they would strip. Mm -hmm. and, but yeah, like, I think I would go there just for... The hilarity. Exactly. Yeah. Versus a strip club. I mean, a strip club is like... I feel like it's an experience at least to do yeah, once or like something. Yeah, there's that. My dad has tried so hard to get me to go to a yeah. strip club. You can't go there yet. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta talk to Medley, man. You okay. haven't talked to her yet. You, you walked right past her, actually. I did? So, oh, yeah. was she in here? This one? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I thought she was gonna... <laughs> huh? Wow! You really do have green clothes and a strange-shaped hat! Just like the stories. You're fucking weird! <laughs> You're Pootsa! Aren't you? Oh, me? I'm an attendant to the Great Sky Spirit Valu. My name is Medley. He's only tried to eat me three times. Well, tell the truth. I'm not intending quite yet. Ugh. Burps. I'm actually still studying to be one. Oh, what am I thinking? Here, this is from the Chieftain. Poonsa! That kind of hurt. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to give you this directly to Prince Kumali. Yeah, here, take whatever. <laughs> <laughs> so, I want I want to preface something. About these, the letter, or these people are the postmen of this entire world. The chief gave the letter to her to give to you to give to his son. <laughs> it's like the U.S. government. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty much the postal service. I, I'm not I am tired of the American people. Trying to get their mail correct. This system needs reform. <laughs> <laughs> feel the medley. <laughs> feel the link or feel the poon saw. There we go. <laughs> feel the poon saw. But seriously though, that is quite humorous. So, by the way, listen. Poon saw. Poon saw. I have a small favor I'd like to ask of you. Will you take me to the dance? <laughs> uh, there's this other girl. I, oh, um, it's, it has nothing to do with that weird beak. I honestly, swear. Honestly, I haven't even met her yet, but I know she's more attractive she, than she's than She's just you. the one. She's just. I'll, yeah. I'll know it when I see her. I, her. I know. Her shield matches my sword. You know. You know <laughs> what I mean. What? <laughs> Could you please come to the entrance of Dragon Rouge Cavern later. Like, it'll be like ten minutes. Uh, I'll explain everything. Ex explain? I will explain everything! <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Downstairs. Is the way you need to go! And there's it, there's there. we have gone way over an episode! Yeah, I was wondering. This one will be cut in half. So... Yeah. Yeah. Next time on Let's Brew. Next time on, on, on Let's I Brew. Will it get better at this whole timey thing. I'm still not good at it. But and I will get better at gameplay. And maybe Connor, by virtue of getting better at gameplay, will get better at reminding me to get better yeah, <laughs> at yeah. setting the time, and then I will remind him to get better at gameplay, and it'll just be a, a lovely, a lovely circle. Lovely circle. We did this joke already. I know. We did I, it I'm, already! I'm gonna still do it a All lot, right. but next time I'm let's Next time. We'll talk to this guy.